dirt is phenomenal. Clocking in Laguna Beach, California. Very, very gloomy morning. I was working on my cranks yesterday and they were actually loose at Troy Lee. And they held up good, they were fine, but they were still loose. I actually like took it apart and checked it out and I got it tight enough to where it works, but I don't think it's tight enough to where it makes me feel confident I guess like this this screw is made out of plastic and it feels like it doesn't get tight anymore and these bolts up top just felt weird when they were going in so I feel like this whole left side crank arm is is feeling weird so I'm gonna ride it today and if it gets loose on me today again on this ride I think I'm just gonna pull the trigger on some new cranks. But I'm not as upset about it. These cranks are as old as the bike. You know, I got this bike in 2021, so the cranks are three years old and I've beat them up. Like they have taken so many hits. So I think it's it's time that I get an upgrade, but we'll see. Today, if, if they do get loose, um, yeah, I'm just gonna pull the trigger, buy something new. You know what was funny too? I was doing some uh, some Googling yesterday and on the Jensen website, these cranks are the cheapest cranks on their website. I think they're like 70 bucks, but I just found that interesting. You can't see the logo anymore, but it, they're Shimano Dior cranks, 32 tooth sprocket, 170 cranks. But yeah, 70 bucks for, for everything. First trail up is gonna be car wreck. I don't know how good it's gonna be. There's a lot of hikers and it's pretty foggy, but we're gonna make the best out of it. And I'll try to wipe my lens as I go down. The weekends, this is a really fun trail, but weekends it's not so fun um, because of the crowdedness, but we're gonna make the best out of it. It is a warm up trail, so I do wanna take it a little bit more chill. Dude, but dirt is looking so much better than I've seen it in the past. I'm down too, dude. I have clear goggles in the truck. I just didn't think. I was hoping it would clear up before we sent the first trail, but that wasn't the case. It's looking good though. Are we gonna get lucky? Clear trail. Oh, sorry. Uh, three more coming down. There's three more down there too. Okay, thank you. I always struggle to make that turn. Oh. Yeah. Thank you so much. Just three more coming. You got it, Papa. Oh! Jeez, dude. If I was going any faster on that piece, I would have went OTV. <laughs> oh, sure. Made it, top climb. 
Um, I think I'm gonna do no goggles on this run because last run I couldn't see anything. This is how I'm gonna, how I'm gonna rock it. Hopefully they don't fall down. But it is still foggy, it's windy, so I feel like I'll still get hit with water and wind, but it'll be better because I can actually see. Yeah, that's the trade-off I have right now. With the goggles, they get fogged up and I can't see, but without goggles, um, my eyes start to water up because of the, the wind. But, I'll take that over, not being able to see. Morning. My bad, my bad. Four more coming. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> oh, I should have. I should have chilled. Oh, shit. What clap, bro? Let me scope out what clap. Nice one, Gabe. Dude, what clap? You heard that? Yeah, dude. I think you brought him back. Probably. <laughs> Yo, I got scared. I thought something broke. That was a very awkward jump, though. I feel like I wasn't really lined up for it right, but I was feeling it. I wanted to send it. I'm gonna go straight this time. I always go to the right. And I feel like straight. A little more. Fast. Oh, oh <laughs> I'm getting too confident in this dirt. <laughs> Alright, we got Alex and Joe at the bottom. Gonna get some. Some footage. Yeah. You want to go first or I go? Go for it. Alright. You too. It's phenomenal. Jeez. These uh these trees up top are are after you. Phew. I was wondering why my bike was making a weird noise on the downhill. Like it didn't feel good. I come to find out this the chain fell off of uh this section right here. There we go. That's better. 
5.88 an hour and 51 minutes. In this time period, like middle of September up until like October, I would say is like my favorite time to ride. If you're ever visiting Southern California and you're doing like an MTB trip uh, and you're in SoCal, I would highly recommend coming like towards the end of September. The trail conditions, the weather, it's all perfect. Like you'll have a freaking great time. I love summer because, you know, that means camping for me and, you know, doing more trips. But I do love winter because since the weather's cooler, the trail conditions get a lot better and I'm able to branch out farther without dying in the heat. But everything about today was just perfect. The cranks didn't get loose on me and I think it's because I properly tightened them with the tool. But I'm still gonna look around. I wanna freshen up that whole bottom part, you know, the, the sprocket, the cranks, and the bottom bracket. I wanna replace everything. I've replaced the bottom bracket once so that's my second bo bottom bracket since I've bought the bike. And then the cranks and the sprocket have been with the bike since day one that I unboxed it. So I'm gonna do some homework. I'm gonna research and uh, try and find something I like for this bike. Dude, but I am starving. Time to cook some breakfast and get this Saturday going. Hope you guys enjoyed and I'll catch you on the next ride.